Hey, this is Cabinets to Go, Salt Lake City, Utah. This is the main showroom. New laminate floor throughout. New drop ceiling and track lighting throughout. We're still short 29 heads from Home Depot. Expected to arrive this week. I'll be in contact with Travis, the store manager. Let him know when those are available. Multiple whips for future islands. Carpet tiles at the front entry because of the sloped floor. Power for under cabinet lighting. Power and switching for puck lights at two locations. Existing storefront. Switching for showroom track lights. Switching for pendant lights. Existing alarm keypad that we were asked to keep by the store manager in case they choose to activate an alarm. It's a conduit chase from the island to the television. Store manager is going to frame out that wall when the cabinets go in to mount his TV to rather than going directly to the masonry wall. Most of the concrete walls in the showroom were kept, prepped, cleaned, and painted. New programmable thermostat. This is the vanity area. Connects to the manager's office. Existing door that has been locked down, hardware removed, painted to match the wall color. Existing door opening leading to the warehouse. Dedicated power for computers. Phone board, the dedicated receptacle. And a conduit chase for phone leading to the other side of the room. Multiple infills, patched, painted to match the block. Existing plumbing cleanouts and terminations that were kept. The busted block boarded over with plywood. Vanities will cover this area. This is the hallway leading into the bathrooms. We have an existing door that the manager had us clean up, paint, replace the hardware and install to close off the bathrooms. Service and sub panel locations and meter in this hallway. First existing bathroom. We used a bonding primer and three coats of paint on the 1968 gold and green FRP painted in modern white. New light fixture, existing fans. Clean and repaint existing doors. Reuse and clean existing fixtures. We put new mirrors, new toilet paper holders, and clean the existing floor. The men's room, same situation. Paint the FRP. Replace the light fixture, the mirror, and the paper holder. Clean the existing fixtures. You see there's some water stains that just couldn't be removed. Toilet seat and this one is very badly stained. Floor came out quite well actually considering the condition it was in when we got here. Again, an existing door. Clean and painted. This door leads to our warehouse. The door has arrived, however, the hollow metal frame has not yet come. Another crew can install that next week when it shows. This is the warehouse. Nothing in here other than demo, three previously existing bathrooms. Put in new lighting, new exit signs. This is the existing furnace and water heater.
the new overhead door that was installed today.